Oh, I didn't see you guys come in. Uh, welcome back to another big time video blog from me. Um, yeah, well, we got a lot of uh, feedback from the RV situation. Last week I talked about my badass plan for a Class C surface to air, the whole shit. Uh, but I'm doing a lot of research on it. I appreciate Katie, all the feedback. Uh, Pop, you as well. Beth, definitely. Uh, Chris, we're going to get this thing rocking right. Uh, but I think I'm definitely sticking with the Class C, I'm trying to work out budgetary requirements in order to make this shit happen. See, I got a couple things I got to do, too, when I get it automatically. I'm going to need my solar panels, and I'll figure it out. It's not just the panels. I need panels, wires, batteries, and shit, because the panels don't make it. You got to store the power that you make in order to run your stuff, so I learned that. So if anybody in the Ohio area has got a lead on some solar panels, hook me up. And also, uh, I need a composting toilet. I don't need one, need one, but I want one. What that does is it takes all your poop. Essentially, it, it's a big bucket of dirt that you poop on and it becomes compost. And then you only got to clean out your... Otherwise, you got a big hose. You got to take all the... The uh, factory term or the industry term is solids and liquids, uh, but it's really poop and pee. I'm not gonna go take a solid. So yeah, so I need that. That's about a thousand, thousand dollars. So that's right, 800 right off the jump for solar shit, toilet business. Uh, yeah, what else I need? Yeah, and then I gotta have like 2,000 in the bank in case my old piece of shit RV breaks down. Maybe I'll need that. So that leaves me with a budget of about seven dollars so i gotta be able to find an rv for seven dollars and uh so i get the rest of stuff going on there but what else i'm gonna do i also figure out instead of selling my butt right mrv what i'll do is i should just take all that money what i'll probably do is just buy like a a kilo of heroin think about this right here's what i was thinking about it. i've been putting a lot of thought into this i get a kilo of heroin and i sell that shit cheap like real cheap I undercut the whole market, then I'll be running the game. See, I'll cut it like it, not to where I'm even not even making a profit, right? I sell it real cheap, and then all these other, like, all the other boys in the game will come to me and they'll be like, yo, what's that? And then I kill those guys, pow. And then I get all their drugs, and all the people that work for them now work for me. And then I'm running the game, making big money. But you think, like, what if they come at you and try to, I'll be like, if they say that I can tell they're going to take me out. I'll be like, I tip my hat to you, you win, let me buy you a beer. Then I put arsenic in that beer and they drink it and they're dead, back on top of the game. I'm telling you, right? And then I'll put their dead body in my composting toilet, chop it up. Cops ain't gonna be digging through poop to find a drug dealer, I'll tell you that. And before I say this video blog is not just gonna, it was gonna be just RV talk, which is dumb. I should make it just all kinds of shit. It's gonna be all my comedy stuff. Speaking of which, I got a couple new big shows I added to the to my uh, my farewell tour, if you will. All right? I'm gonna be well. I'm gonna be at Margate next Saturday, which is the 27th, for my big Margate fan base. Everyone in Margate's just shitting their pants to see my show. And then July is the big big run. July 6th, I got uh, Beck Hill's gonna be there. Uh, Jenny Collier. Uh, James Loveridge, uh, three of my favorite ladies. Uh, then July 7th, the next day, I got Dane Batiste will be there, uh, Jade Adams, pal, and then still the 11th is the big time show with the Hen and Chicken, so that's all going on. Running the motherfucking game, selling heroin. So yeah, so I need, anybody knows anything about, keep your eyes open for Oh, the other thing is, I was thinking last time I was talking about, do I get a vehicle or not? So I was learning about towing a vehicle. And there's certain vehicles that are better for towing. They said the best type of vehicle is like a little 4x4 four four because of the way you can dinghy tow it, which means all four wheels are on the ground as opposed to having a dolly. So that way you can just, you can Google that shit yourself and figure it out. But anyway, if anyone in the Greenville area or Ohio in general has got the lead on like maybe like a shitty old Jeep Wrangler, Hook me up with that shit Cause I need a car first I think I do And that way like when I'm running the game If I gotta hit the gas and get the fuck out of there 
I'll just hop in my little jalopy. Uh, yeah, so that's about it for this. So again, uh, solar panels, toilet, RV, gigs, uh, running the game. That's a recap of what you just watched, in case you don't know. This is still my video blog channel. Any questions, concerns, comments, please comment below. These videos are a total shit. I should really focus on them and think about what I'm going to do first, but I don't have time for that. I don't have time for that. What a fucking waste of your time. I can't believe you're watching this shit. Get a fucking job, motherfuckers. I don't know anything about heroin. Other than it looks really fun. That's why that people reckon they're shit to get it. Bow, bow, bow. Motherfucker.